Well, thank you, Council, and thank you, Mayor Taylor, for agreeing to allow us to uh, present this to you by distance. Uh, my name is Mike, and I'm representing uh, the Mottville Uniting Church Council. Um, and again, I'd like to express my thanks to you for allowing us to uh, present our uh, proposal in this manner. Uh, first of all, I just thought I'd let you know a little bit about Mottville Uniting Church. Um, I'm sure you know the location near the new retirement village in the uh, new residential estate. Uh, of course, we moved from right near the main street where we were in the uh, tiny old building and now we've got quite a new building. Uh, but that's kind of beside the point for today. I thought I'd let you know a little bit about our demographics. We've got an age range of mostly 60 to 80 year olds. Uh, a lot of Mottville Uniting Church is filled with retirees who have made a fairly good income for themselves and have elected to move uh, into the bush uh, with a desire to sort of get back closer to nature. And of course, Mottville does have the advantage of only being 20 minutes from some beautiful beaches as well. So it uh, really fits in with the sea change and tree change uh, categories of people looking to move away from the city after their working life is over. Uh, they're also quite a wealthy congregation because of this, and predominantly uh, middle-class Anglo-Saxons. Although we do have a few uh, people who have immigrated in from Italy, South Africa, Great Britain, France, and uh, various other nations in Europe, um, and very few in the Middle East as well. We do have a few younger families in Mottville Uniting Church. Uh, they're mostly new arrivals to the area, attracted by the tourism trade and uh, the service trade that can be done there. A couple of them are uh, taking up farming. There are quite a lot of dairy and uh, wool farms around the Mottville area, as you'd know, and some of these families are involved in those. The church has been growing slightly through new retirees and through transplants uh, from the city but of course we've also been decreasing slightly because of natural death when the age range is uh, 60 to 80 year old you do get quite a few funerals uh, so while the church has overall grown slightly um, as a general rule it's just new old people replacing passing away old people there's a specific style about Mockville United Church which is uh, very traditional you would most likely call it a traditional conservative worship style. The music comes from the Australian hymn book and there's no Sunday school at present because there are very few young families there. Mottville Uniting Church recognises that they have a mission to the elderly and primarily that is where their congregation is formed from. They do however have a great desire to grow youth and family uh, within the church and have started up a playgroup which is held in the church hall as a way to serve this. Now this isn't a Christian organisation but some of the uh, congregation members do in fact stay to serve tea, coffee, snacks to the uh, mums who attend the playgroup and they're very appreciative of that. The Mottville Uniting Church has a very hard working and warm congregation. They, they truly do uh, provide a welcoming culture to people who are who approach. Unfortunately, because they are mostly 60, 70, 80 year olds, despite the welcoming culture, they find it very hard to attract young families because of the differences in age, and they find it difficult to bridge that gap. They're resistant to change in their styles of worship and the way they do uh, their church, but they have plenty of discretionary time with which to serve both the church and the different forms of mission that Mottville United Church seeks to have. 